what's the difference between European motor oil and American motor oil? And if there even is a difference? Well, we're gonna find out next. This video is sponsored by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper. Visit us online for more information. Well, everybody on this side of the pond was focused on the 5,000 or 7,000 mile oil change, the folks over in Europe were already on the 10,000 mile or more oil change for their vehicles. This was part of an environmental mandate to help reduce the waste stream coming from a vehicle during its entire life. They don't abide by ILSAC or API, but they have a standard set forth by the European Automobile Manufacturers Association, or ASEA. These standards are based on testing and development on European engines. Just like the US, well, their standards are always constantly improving every few years. Every time they introduce a new oil standard to suit the engines that are being introduced on the roads. For instance, they change the oil specifications when gasoline direct injection was involved, and they also are constantly changing the oil specification for diesel engines. In addition, ASEA and ILSAC are trying to keep the AB, which is typically for gasoline engines, in line with GF5 and SN specification. So there's some communication between the two standard groups. This way, there's no huge compatibility problems for the oil installed in a vehicle when it comes over here. But keep this in mind, ASEA, ILSAC, and SAE are talking to each other. They wanna make sure that even if a car is built in Europe and then sold in America, there are no huge compatibility problems with the oil. So they work together. But you should make sure that you check the oil label to make sure that it meets an ASEA specification for a European vehicle. The manufacturers of the vehicles have also introduced their own oil standards. VW, for example, introduces an oil grade probably about every other year. These usually trump the ASEA certifications. The same is here with GM and Dexos. Make sure that you check with the oil supplier if the standard of the oil matches the vehicle that you're installing it in. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.